If you're a marketer or an agency owner that sells anything, I am going to expose for free today in this video a book that costs more than an Audi QA rental, but less than a Bugatti daily rental. How do you know? Well, check this out. So a Bugatti, it costs 25K to rent for a day. And an Audi Q8, it costs less. Okay, so you can see the price right here. So step one, what you're going to do and learn in this book, the book is called Only Versus Best. You don't want to be compared to any other agency or marketer or product creator out there. Uh, because then you're going to have to compete on price. You're going to have to compete on, uh, you know, how loud you can shout or how viral you can go. You don't want that. What if you only had 200 people watch your video, <clears throat> but what you have is so unique, you positioned yourself differently to solve whatever problem, uh, bring them away from pain or towards pleasure so uniquely that they just pay for it, right? So this book, has stuffed $200,000 worth of services into a 197 book. That is why this book costs that much. Now, I'm going to show you today for free what is in there. This is a formula, three steps where you can sell anything and have inbound sales coming to you. All right. So check this out. <clears throat> First step is you want to position yourself. All right. If you don't position yourself, I don't know why people are running paid ads. This is why I'll see these agency videos talking about some uh, in order to get a client meeting or book a client appointment or something through Facebook. They spent like $100 on an ad and people consider that as good. <laughs> I mean, well, good for you if you think $100 per appointment is good. But guess what? If you were running ads and you were already positioned, meaning the traffic wasn't cold, then it would not cost a hundred bucks to get on a call with someone. That is crazy. All right. So position yourself. What do I mean? Be the most rare. Check this out. Both of these are diamonds, guys. But this one is the most rare, the red diamond. This is the round diamond that a lot of you guys buy your wives and stuff. But this is the red diamond. So what do I mean? You can be a marketing agency, AI, automation agency, SEO, uh, all of that extra stuff. But I just did a video earlier about how to get, uh, how to be the only one people buy from ever. All right. So you want to be different. You want to be unique. What do I mean? Offer a different service. Okay. If you have the same service as somebody else, well, guess what? Deliver it in a different way then. How do you position yourself as the only, okay? So you learn in the um, the only versus best book at the profitpositioningagency.com site, you learn how to position yourself as the only option that provides blank service. You're the only one that a person, you practice this exercise, guys, fill in the blanks, right? I am the only blank that can offer blank to blank, Okay. I am the only one that does it like this. I'm the only one that delivers this. I'm the only one that created that. How do you become the only? Now, prove the market, of course. Nobody's saying reinvent the wheel, but then become the only. That way you don't compete on price. So that book is a step-by-step -step for how to become the only. I am the only, for example, one that can offer legally the market monopoly. I figured out how to do that. Okay, this is why I charge 200K soon to be going up on my site for local businesses, 200K, right? So in this book, you will learn how to create a 200K or a million dollar offer if you want to by being the most rare in your market, okay? You're still an SEO agency, but how do you create an offer that makes you rare where they can't say, I heard it all before. Somebody sent me an email with this pitch. OK, oh, somebody told me they're going to automate this. They're going to connect Zapier and and stack flows and and chat bots and all of the bull crap. And they're going to charge me two thousand dollars a month. They heard it already. So position yourself. You are the most valuable. Right. I tell you how to cut the legs out from under those who assume that they are competition by crippling them. What do I mean by that? The things that they charge for. Flip that around and offer that as your lead magnet for free. 
So if people are charging two thousand dollars, you know they're you know they're DMing people, and these people are responding back and they're telling them five hundred to two thousand dollars. Well, guess what? DM those same people and what they were charging two thousand dollars for, give that away as the Leemart magnet. Make that for free, okay? And then charge on things that other people can't replicate or make it extremely difficult for them to replicate. You understand? So become the most rare. Make it to where people are excited when they hear about your offer. For example, I'm positioning my book, this only versus best book, I tell people that I am stuffing that $200,000 service that is on my site inside of a 197 book. Now 197 books don't sound like, uh, $197 don't sound like a lot when you know that you're going to learn the formulas and laws that it took for me to create the market monopoly that I charge 200K for. You understand? So first position yourself, become an authority. What skill do you have that is valuable, that is uh, that can be used differently from others? You understand? Okay, so now let's go to the next step. The next step is to leverage others. <clears throat> All right, so step one was to position yourself. Step two is leverage others. Okay, so what do I mean by that? Okay, now that you are an authority, now that you have uh, some brand positioning, maybe you went and you ranked yourself on Google, maybe you created an irresistible offer and, and blasted it out, and now you're known for that. What are you known for? That's your positioning. The, your position, let me, let me give you a good definition. Your positioning answers the question that most clients or customers have when they come to you. Why should I buy from you versus somebody else? How you position yourself answers that automatically. When you prospect to them, when you get on a call with them or whatever it is, they can't say, well, you know, there's other guys charging this for blank. Why don't I just go with this guy? Why should I choose you? He got more testimonials, blah, 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 and he charges less. See, this is the thing. That's why I said position yourself as unique. Then they can't say that. The answer, the answer will manifest itself when they ask why they should buy from you. Okay? So now, since you're positioned... You don't have to be famous. When I say position, I'm not famous. Like that doesn't matter. But when I uh, uh, do a presentation to someone, whether that's a webinar or if I was to get on a call with someone, they can't compare me to anyone else. There's nobody they can find that does the same thing unless it's a, one of you guys, a student that I've taught. You understand? Like this is not going to be something that they just get emails from uh, or for all day or DMs all day. Right. So now, since you're positioned, you can leverage others. What do I mean by others? OK, well, number one right here, as you can see, I practice what I preach. I have my own affiliate network. I have an army of affiliates. I had to pump them up again, pause, because I haven't really been dealing with it lately since I've been focusing on the school. But revive the affiliate army. These are commission-based salespeople, basically, that are trained to use their own time, money, efforts, resources, skills, uh, social media accounts, ad accounts, Gmails, all of that extra stuff and tools, right? In order to bring me sales without me paying them a dime until they get me sales. So you want to have an established base base of affiliates okay no matter what you're selling if you're an agency if you're an if you're an affiliate yourself how do you get your following to start promoting your affiliate offers for you instead of you being around running the ads like dog you can literally go to clickbank get an offer that will pay you three to four hundred dollars commission and then just create a successful ad right? Like make sure it's successful and then have a case study for yourself and then ask people if they want to make some money too and say, okay, I'm going to give you the same ad and show you how to tweak it so that it's unique. And then I'm going to split this with you. 
I mean, even affiliates can get affiliates, guys. You don't even have to have your own product. So step one is get affiliates, okay? So we talk about that in the profit, uh, in the only versus best book on profitpositioningagency.com, okay? Then next step is JV Partners, all right? This can even be other agencies. So I talk about how to turn your uh, competition, so-called competition, into collaborators. This gives you endless inventory, endless supply, for the demand. You understand? You're never out. So if you were selling cars, if you made uh, uh, collaborations or if you made joint ventures with all of the dealerships in the city instead of being their competitors, then you'll have en endless supply of cars. Why do you think Toro is so popular? If you were like a platform like Airbnb, you have endless rentals when people come to the city. Because you are not competition, you collaborate with the people that have all of the dang on properties. Do you understand? Be that, be the plug, okay? Now, JV partners, collect those. Then you have acquisitions, merger, ac mergers and acquisitions. So what do I mean by that? You can, uh, uh, you can collaborate with people to get into their audiences and everything. For example, if one of you guys, like I have huge email lists and I got multiple YouTube channels. I know you guys watch these business videos, but like, oh, this dude don't have that many views. This is, <laughs> this is a boring business channel. I have a crap load of channels, right? Um, so check this out. Let's say that you had a, a product, like you were a martial artist. I have a new channel called AJU Battles, AJU Battles, that I talk about like battle stuff, battle rap, uh, UFC type stuff like that. And every video gets thousands of views, every video. What if you had a martial arts product, some type of learn jujitsu from home MMA course or something? Whenever I did a review on a UFC fight, I could feature you or I can interview you on your martial arts experience. That would be a, a JV, right? Now, let's say you wanted to do acquisitions. You could be smart with that same product and you could write down a list of Facebook groups, write down a list of uh, YouTube channels and you can start putting out offers to purchase those. If you're a marketing agency right now, okay, you can find groups about social media or you can find local buy, sell, trade or local businesses only uh groups for your cities and everything and purchase those and now since you purchase those groups and these instagram accounts and all of that you decide what is posted and promoted on there you don't have to buy shout outs anymore you're the one that's controlling the pages and the groups and all of that stuff and the channels right disney just bought a youtube channel for 100 and many, uh, 150 million dollars so acquisitions is powerful because now they can release a trailer uh, across that entire syndicate of channels and know that they're going to get a lot of views for that movie trailer. How do you do that? You create an offer. You want it to get a lot of reach. If you uh, took on acquisitions, like, okay, I'm going to buy a whole bunch of plastic surgery groups because I know that plastic surgeons are in there. So whenever I have a new plastic surgery offer, I can just post it in all of those groups because now I control them, right? <laughs> Acquisitions. So one, affiliates, which is pretty much, like, yeah, that's easy, but you need to be an authority. Of, you need to position yourself first, get some wins, and then people will want to follow you. Affiliates are basically just people that don't well, they might not want to start their own business. They rather promote someone else's product and get a cut from that. So, but they want to know that the product is, is working, right? So go ahead and get you a good case study and then make that public and then recruit affiliates, okay? Then JV partners, you can create JV partners like today. I mean, just reach out to people that would find value in what you have to offer that you can also uh, find value on what they have to offer and just pretty much swap, right? So promotion swap, if you want to call it that, right? Uh, and then acquisitions. Okay, so step one was position yourself. Number two is leverage others. Now we're going to go to one of my favorite parts right here. Oh, snap. Matter of fact, 
before I move on, I want you guys to comment document below and then I'll give you a document. I'm going to email you. You might, I don't know if you want to put your email public. Uh, just, just comment below, right? Uh, document below. And I'm going to email you a document that has over 29 ways to leverage a human being. This is how these billion, billion dollar companies look like they're giving things to us for free, but they're like amassing great wealth behind the scenes. For example, welfare, housing authority, food stamps, all of that extra stuff, that stuff looks like a gift, but behind the scenes they're making, your birth certificate is worth millions of dollars, right? Like, so I'm going to send you a document. Just that is the worth of this book. Okay, that, that I'm talking about today on a profit position in the agency site, right? Okay, so comment that below and I'll send you that for free, all right? Now, last step. Step number three is profit recycle. This is my favorite one. You can consider this putting, adding fuel to the fire, okay? This is adding fuel to the fire. Right now, you might not be able to invest in ads. When I first started out, y'all, I didn't have no credit card. My parents messed my dang on credit up, right? I never really had credit cards. So while all of these, this is why I tell you, stop watching testimonials and become one. While all these other dudes is talking about to me, yeah, man, I just, uh, you know, ran some ads on my card. And, uh, you know, uh, after a couple hundred bucks, I had a couple people on the calendar and then I closed my first client. Ah, Ta-da, you know, <laughs> that sounds cool, right? But what if you got to use cash to run ads? What if you don't have a credit card you can pay off at the end of the freaking month, right? So profit recycle, what you do up front first, you don't have, it doesn't have to cost money. Position yourself. There's a lot of ways you can position yourself. You can do that with SEO and there's a lot of free ways to rank. You can do that with content creation, like literally pick a niche topic and just zone in and create and uh, answer more questions, solve more problems in that niche than anybody else. Like dog, I got, I had, I got a loan channel, uh, a payday loan channel for three years. That mug was giving us like three to 500 bucks a week without me doing anything. And it only took me a weekend to record all of those videos. I recorded a video for every single keyword you can think of that was a loan created on YouTube. And I uploaded them all at once, unlisted and uh, linked them all to each other as if I'm doing like a website. I link, interlinked them all. And then I blasted them all out, made them public at the same time. And they all ranked at the same time. I don't know if that works anymore, but <laughs> for years, we was just getting on autopilot crazy loans because we were positioned anything you typed in. It doesn't matter if it was a loan for farming equipment. We was on YouTube for that, okay? So do that. And it didn't cost me anything but time. Position yourself. OK, so now once you're this authority, you can leverage others. And I showed you through JV partners, joint venture partners, I mean, um, affiliates and then acquisitions when you got a little bit of money. Now, now that you've done those two steps, you position yourself to leverage others. You are going to have some money. If you follow those properly, you're going to have money. OK, and then that allows you to profit recycle, meaning toss a percentage of that money, reinvest that, put it back into it to speed it up because money is also leverage. Remember, at the beginning, you didn't really have that much to invest. Right. You ain't had that much cash like in your pocket to invest. So now you can use that for ads and speed things up, ramp it up, blah, blah, blah. Right. Extend your reach further places. And, and all of that, right? Or you can use it to hire help, see? So you profit recycle, and then it's just gonna create this snowball effect that then comes down that mountain and turns into a freaking avalanche of sales, okay? And what does that result into? That results in you having dominion. The Bible says to have dominion, all right? So you got the whole world in your hands of your market, right? Of your industry, your niche. So you get to have dominion. Position yourself to leverage others, to profit, recycle, and that gives you dominion. Now, <laughs> this is just a video, a free video, guys. I told you it's 200K 
worth of tactics and strategies and the thought process of how we created the market monopoly inside this book right here. Okay, so instead of paying $197,000, like we get one of them every now and then, a lot of people ain't got that. You got to market to the right people, right? You definitely ain't going to get a $197,000 client from YouTube. You got to get that from somewhere else, which, yeah, anyway, you'll learn that type of stuff in the book. Okay, and there's a new book cover now, but this is what it looks like on the site. And you get the ebook and the audio book. So instead of 200K, it is only 197 today, which I'll probably increase the price of this book too, because it's just crazy. It's going to create a lot of millionaires and maybe even more just from this book. And the funny thing about it is this book is not even that long. You can listen to it in under a freaking hour. You can read it in under a day. You get the ebook version and the audio version. Uh, first book of its kind, revealing how to dominate your market sales effortlessly using market monopolies. So you get to create your own monopoly in whatever you're selling. So this is why this book right here costs more than an Audi Q8 rental, but less than a Bugatti daily rental. Did I lie about that? Did I hold up my end of the bargain? You can go to Profit Positioning Agency dot com profit positioning agency go get it right about now at the profit positioning agency dot com website guys uh we productize majority of our services because i really don't like getting clients i like partners and stuff like that but the only service we have is like extremely high ticket services so instead of you paying for services why don't you go to the source of the matrix main mind frame, right? Like mainframe, right? Like this book right here will show you how to create $200,000 offers, million dollar offers, right? Where you don't have to book your calendar with a million people. What if one client could bring you six figures, not a year per month? Then would you need to get 20, 30,000, uh, 20, uh, 20 or 30 uh, clients at 100? <laughs> 20 or 30 clients at a thousand dollars a month a lot of people are telling y'all to get that like two thousand three thousand dollar clients a month and that only happens when you have to compete with price you understand compete by price when you have something that's not unique when it's common and that goes against step one positioning yourself right so what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Make sure you comment at the word document so that I can email you guys the document of how to leverage a human in 29 different ways. Love you guys. Take action because there is no cash in without action.